Hello everybody, I'm the Epic Nintendo Fan 64 and today, uh, this is my man cave, you might have seen the live stream and today I'm actually going to do something, something like a normal video game, a normal Nintendo YouTuber would do. I'm going to do a, do a Nintendo review for once, an actual proper review. Let me just, I don't know why, so I'm just going to turn my TV on and find me really loud. Also, I, I, I still have a VHS player. Let me just turn my volume down a bit. Well, that'll be alright, that'll be alright. 20... Yeah, so this is my trusty little NES, I love it, it's an absolute classic. Oh, Super Mario, Free Super Mario Free's in there. I don't really want to review that one. Oh, I want to review... Rad Racer! Now, I'm just gonna, just gonna do something right now, I'm just gonna put my game back in its box. Yes, the only NES game I bought in its box! Because it's such a classic and such an amazing game, and I, own, and I got it for only 30 quid with the manual and the and the special NES poster. Just trying to get it back in. I don't want to damage the box, but I think for a second you just couldn't see nothing. I might cut this out. Okay, there we go. So now that's all done. I'm going to review an NES game. Let me just get it on the right extension. Extension 2. NES. Now, what game should I play? Rad Racer. Yeah, this Rad... I, think I find this game a bit obscure. Not obscure, a bit... Underrated, really. I don't know why, I just do. I honestly, I just find this game a bit underrated, Rad Racer. Please don't blink. Stop blinking! That happens a lot of my NES. It blinks an awful lot. Let me just try. There's another way people could, people used to put in NES games. They used to. Not that many people did it, but I do. Blink! Blink! Okay. Again, I might cut this part out. Probably I'm going to cut this. So right now, you'll probably see nothing for about another two seconds. And it'll hit me. Trying to put in an NES game. I think we should cut this bit out. Uh... Okay, there we go. I just had to like put it in a bit less far. And here's Rad Racer on the NES. This game is a bit over a, a bit no, a bit very underrated in my opinion. And uh, I think most people remember it for using the power glove in the 1989 awful film The Wizard. Most of people love this game, but well, I love it. But I also find it very underrated. And if anybody Fix the F1 machine is either one, you're a nerd, two, you're a nerd, and if anybody ever picks the F1 machine, they should get their Nintendo Fun Club or Nintendo Power License ripped up to shreds because, let's face it, who picks the F1 machine? No, no, I'm not picking the F1 machine. There, twin turbo. No. Here we go. The Twin Turbo. This game also has 3D, but I have 3D glasses, I just didn't bring them. Anyway, this is what the 3D looks like. And I won't really be able to play it that well because... Hang on, I'm just trying to play it with one hand. Playing NES with one hand is kind of impossible. Um, I'll just pause it and talk to you about it. So yeah, this is Rad Racer, a very good retro Nintendo game. And I find it a bit... I said a bit, not a lot bit um underrated Hang on. this is the way i play nintendo with one hand 
I can't stretch my fingers. Oh, here we go. Uh, yeah, this is rap. Oh, and it also has some radio stations you can pick. There's three songs. This is my favourite one. I don't know why. Da, 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 da. I might be copying back the NES punk, but I'll be making my own lyrics, kind of. Da, da, da. This hit rap rap racer. I feel it is very rad. This song makes me feel very depressed. And my timer is coming down. I must race for my life. Rad racer. What this game is like a copy of Outrun. What is even going on? Why am I off the track? Game over. Let's just try it again. I actually did not bad for one hand. Anyway, yeah, Rad Racer, an absolute classic NES game. And I think it's mostly famous for being in The Wizard. The film The Wizard with the power glove. And remember remember, the, remember Lucas, he said, Lucas in The Wizard. The, the character, that he said, I love the power glove. It's so bad. I think he should have said Rad, like Rad Racer, though. Like, why, why did you not... I'm sorry you can't really see the background very well, but... The background is nice palm trees, nice early Nintendo background. Oh, now you can see it. They're fine, finally focused. So this game's an absolute classic in my opinion. Oh, and the same person that did the music and made this game, I think, is the same person who did Final Fantasy! Oh, what? I was trying to drift and I actually turned the radio station. Oh, I'm losing my special stuff. Da, 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 da. This reminds me of like, like a spy theme or something. I don't know. I'm not very. I, I suck at Rad Racer. This game is so hard, in my opinion. Mario, what do you think of this game? Mario, look at him. What do you think of this game? I think it's a uh, okie dokie. That's not your opinion, that's Mario's opinion. No, it's a my opinion. I don't care, Luigi. Anywho, this game's an absolute classic and I love it. I think it's a bit underrated, but yeah, I think there's well I haven't I've never got actually got past round course one, Sunset Coastline. <coughs> but I think it's actually really hard. I think this game's really hard because all those cars, some of them, just knock you off the truck and then you land in the palm trees and then, and then your car just flips over! Why does it do that? I don't know! I don't know! This is an early Nintendo! Early Nintendo was hard, so deal with it! Oh. Oh, I'm going fast. Get away from those cars! Can't you go any slower, you... Can't you go any faster, any slower, you can't! You're just... Oh, am I going so slow? Come on then, you cars. Just hurry up a little bit. Please. This is my review and I don't even know what I'm doing. Yeah! Um, so... Rad Racer. It's a great NES game. Absolutely classic. And uh, Hang on, I'm just going to show you what happens when you go into one of the things. Yep. Your car literally just flips over and you have to do it again. Especially when the cars get hit you, it's even worse. I hate that you're timed, but sometimes you even get like a little continue when you go like 200 miles per hour or over, which I actually love about this game. Come on, focus. Why aren't you focusing? Thank you. Okay, so, Rad Racer, it's an absolute classic, and, oh, hang on, I'll just, actually, should I reset? I might, but I'm just going to show you how awesome this game is. I absolutely love it. And I get very frustrated when I play early, when I play Retro Nintendo, as you might have just saw. And I actually, I absolutely love this game. I think it's an absolute classic. And get out of my way, you car! Okay, okay, alright, alright, you want to go? You want to go? You want to go? Oh, do you? Do you? Do you, mate? Oh, really? I think you don't. What's going on? Alright, get out of my way. I said, get out of my way! Get out of my way! Hurry up! Okay, so... Oh, no, 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 there we go, there we go, there we go, that's good, that's good. This is like a Let's Play channel, so, ooh, it's on 3D mode on. Okay, so, Rad Racer, 
an absolute classic NES game. I think you must play it. It's not that cheap, actually. No, it's, it's very cheap, actually. I think I got it for £12, so that's amazing. It's a really fun, really fun NES game. If you just want to kill some time, play Rad Racer. If you want to have, like, a really retro cool NES game, play Rad Racer. It's an absolute classic NES driving game. I think it... And if, if if anybody missed out that I said it's a copy of Outrun, yeah, it is kind of a ripoff of Outrun, but that also adds to the charm. This is basically the NES's version of Outrun, which I love. I love Rad Racer. Yeah, I love Rad Racer. It's so bad. As in good. Yeah. Okay. I might just keep continue playing because I actually can't stop playing this game. It's like a weird addiction, but it's not an addiction. Of course it's not. I'm not weird. I just love Rad Razor, okay? It's a classic NES game. If if you ever see it anywhere, or if you want to buy it, then... I think... I didn't, I didn't buy it at Amazon, no, no. I actually bought it at a shop. It's called the Retro Shop. And it was a very nice shop, a very lovely shop. And they have loads of good deals, and I'm not trying to advertise them, but... They're really good, and... Anywho, yeah, they, I, I actually bought it to the real, proper retro gaming shop. And I love Rad Racer. I think I love Retro Nintendo. Look at all the games I've got. Super Mario Brothers, yay! Double Dragon, yay! Hang on, I'll just get them all. Okay, Super Mario Brothers! Double Dragon! DuckTales! Bionic Commando! Adventure Island 2! And what's the last one? Mario Bros and Duck Hunt. I don't actually know why I own this. I just do because I thought I was getting this. I got this before I actually got my Nintendo. Thinking I wouldn't get a game of it. Oh, and of course, the amazing Super Mario Bros. 3! Oh, and of course, Rad Racer. So, everybody, thank you all for watching my decent, my very okay review of Rad Racer on the NES. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye-bye, and this has been the Epic Nintendo Fan 64. Woo! Bye-bye, everybody. And thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye, and thanks for watching.